hi all i am guru here i am back to you people so guys today i would like to discuss with you people only on uh, with respect to interview okay interview on testing okay basically the technical panel who they are going to decide whether you are fit into their project or not for example i am a project manager i wanted to take an interview and i will tell my resources like a test lead and all i will ask them can you take a one round of technical interview and totally they will have two rounds of three rounds of technical interview it depends on their process and their criteria how they wanted to decide to take an interview okay let us see so they are planning to take a two rounds of technical interview and one round is a hr round for their project work because they need a resources as urgent as possible okay now what they will do they wanted to take a two rounds of interview imagine that xyz person he went for an interview and uh, uh, and they will start they will start discussing with him and they will call him for an interview for a technical discussion first round interview and two people they wanted to discuss with him two people senior senior testing people they wanted to discuss with him regarding the technical questions because you will be working with him once you get select in that organization so initially we should understand what actually what exactly the two people are expecting from that particular resources okay they wanted to see your experience level before before calling you and for an interview right they wanted to shortlist your profile with the particular points what they want okay so in that situation in that point they will call you for a technical discussion and they wanted to discuss with you okay first they wanted to see just they wanted to ask you about your introductory part means they wanted to understand about you what kind of experience you have and that experience will fit into their project or not both they will discuss about them and they will uh, they will discuss with you hey guys uh, can you can you brief about yourself can you uh, can you tell me your past experience where you worked okay and the person who went for an interview right he should behave very professionally very professionally in front of them let him explain about his his experience what kind of experience he has and which project he was involved and what is his role so they will listen your experience and they will talk to you one person will start discussing with you people with you person and he will ask okay so can you can you tell me what kind of project you have executed being a qa engineer and what was your role in that what is your role what role you have played in your project then you need to explain very systematically very confidently what work you have done guys your confidence level your communication skills and way of your interaction matters a lot while explaining yourself couple of people i found they did a very good work in the project but they could not able to explain professionally to the technical panel so these are the mistakes we should not do while delivering our stuff in front of a technical panel so first you need to explain them what role you have played in the project work and what kind of experience you have okay and even they may ask you okay if i give you one project for a testing project so what what is your approach how you wanted to do the testing on that project particular project so they will tell you openly they don't have a requirement and this is a new project it is coming to them nothing it is you need to work from the scratch what what is your approach how you wanted to work on that testing project and they will ask you okay if if you follow particular process can you explain me what are the challenges you have faced while doing a work on that particular project okay so then they may, they and you need to answer in such a way that you need to drag them in your way where you knows pull them don't go with them you pull them you should have some interesting answers where and another thing is once you know the answer tell them very frankly yes this is how it works and it doesn't mean that you should know whole and soul no so if you don't know answer you you should you should tell them you should tell them like you have not come across with such kind of situations in your past experience you should not tell them you don't know directly 
okay you should tell them very professionally no sir i have not come across with such kind of uh, uh, situations in my past experience okay and if you know the answer tell them you know pakka tell them confidently yes and the way of your explanation the way of your communication should be very strong because so unless and until you do the real time project work right you will not get that much of confidence to explore yourself in front of a technical panel okay and convey the messages and one person is going to conduct an interview another person will be silent okay once the person who has completed his interview right he will tell i am done with my my side of interview another person will start discussing with you person with you people okay can you brief me what kind of testing process you have followed up okay do you know automation do you know manual do you know agile okay so everything what are the contents on in your profile right they will go according to your your contents of your profile and guys whenever you are going for an interview right you should be 100% pakka with your profile what do you see pin to pin information of profile you should know practically then only you can explain them very well what kind of work you have done okay and so another thing is so once the both of people they have done with your interview guys right, they will ask you one question called do you have any questions for me that is a professional way of conducting an interview they will ask you i do you have any questions for me then you should hit them back very properly okay and you you, you should not tell like you 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 don't have any question you should ask him right you should ask him like suppose if i got into your project which which domain i need to work and uh, and uh, like which domain i need to work and what is the interesting interesting point like uh, do you want me to work on healthcare do you want me to work on a uh, banking project and uh, and what kind of project you were looking out and where i should be deployed in the project if if, if i got selected then they will explain you okay we, we we are recruiting you for the couple of projects we have in house projects and we have clients projects available once you get into the project work we will deploy in this particular project guys whenever they ask you do you have any questions reply them back very professionally okay and one more thing once you once you interview is over first round two people have taken your interview they will they will tell you to wait outside okay both of them they will discuss what kind of what kind of uh, the communication this guy is having and what is his presentation skills and how technically he is and main they will look into your confidence level guys confidence is a very important because tomorrow you are working with a client they will leave you in front of the client you need to talk to the client and you need to communicate the work what work you have done to the customers very professionally we call it as a business communication skills what is your business communication skills and how best you are exploring yourself and what is your presentation skills everything they would like to analyze once they will decide both of them they will decide okay this candidate is good they will send you for the second round interview in the second round interview then and there itself they will tell you you will have a second round interview if panel is available interview panel is available they will take your second round interview suppose interview panel is not available they have not scheduled for a second round of interview they will tell you we will tell you later on and you may get a call from tomorrow or today so we will schedule your second round interview guys there are some preparation you need to do before getting into the technical discussion come with me i would like to help you out i would like to guide you what are the real questions they are going to ask you and how best you are professionally you are going to interact with them this is very important sessions which i am going to conduct guys who all are interested don't don't hesitate interact with me i would like to guide you and go through my youtube 1111 link is really fabulous really good it is you will learn so many things but if you wanted to learn in depth of the project work execution and all the guidance join with my session i am pretty much happy to help you out guys thank you thanks a lot guru and we will meet once again and please look into my youtube it is one of the best sessions i am providing in the youtube and really if you wanted to learn really if you wanted to work with me definitely guys i am going to help you out interact with me and talk to me on myself which is which i am living in the 
uh, in the descriptions. You talk to me. I would like to help you out. Thank you, guys. Thanks a lot. Meet you once again. See you. Have a nice day. Good Friday. Thank you. Thanks a lot.